Hi, I'm Marcy Bailey with Bailey's Fine Jewelry, and today we're gonna to be talking about types of metal used to make jewelry, specifically yellow gold versus rose gold. We often get questions from our clients about what the difference is and which is better for your jewelry. It's important to understand that when you buy gold jewelry, the metal is not pure gold. Pure gold is an incredibly soft element that would not be suitable for daily or even occasional wear if someone were to make jewelry out of it. When 14 karat gold is created, the pure gold is mixed with other metals like copper, zinc, and silver to form a much stronger alloy that is suitable to jewelry making. You may have heard of 14 karat, 18 karat, or even 20 karat gold in the past, and this refers to the amount of alloy that is mixed with the pure gold. The higher the number, the more pure gold. The more pure gold in the alloy, the more saturated the color. For example, 18 karat gold is 75% pure gold, and 14 karat gold is 58% pure gold. When rose gold is created, copper is mixed with pure gold and other metals to create that warm pink color. Rose gold has a range of colors from a soft pink to bright copper, and this range is based on how much copper is in the mixture. In 1842, a British jeweler named William Holden patented rose gold and sold it under the name American Pink. His invention was an attempt to imitate the look of the copper coins that were popular in America during this time period. When it comes to deciding between yellow gold and rose gold for your jewelry, there are things to consider with both. Yellow gold is one of the most classic metal colors and will give your jewelry a timeless look. Modern yellow gold is much more refined and muted than the bright, chunky yellow gold that was used in the 80s and before. Yellow gold is a little more susceptible to nicks and scratches than rose gold, but with routine cleaning and maintenance, you won't notice a big difference at all. Rose gold is definitely a more recent trend in the jewelry world, but is certainly becoming more and more popular. It's loved for its feminine color and blushy rose hue. Rose gold does tend to be stronger and more resistant to nicks and scratches because there is a higher amount of copper in the alloy and copper is a very strong element. If you're trying to decide on a metal color for your engagement ring, keep in mind that you can always set your diamond in white gold or platinum prongs with a yellow or rose gold band so that the warmth of the gold doesn't affect the perceived color of your stone. As always, if you have questions about metal colors or maintenance for your jewelry, visit us in store, online, or send us a message on social media. Thanks for watching, and be sure to like, comment, and subscribe below.